<laughs> I want you to see something because some people think that when I show them videos of peace that it's supposed to be absolutely silent. Um, no, it's actually integrated into reality. It's not supposed to be... Um, it's not supposed to be unreal. So there's no contradiction between the heavenly peace that we're looking at above and the normal action that we're looking at below. Ooh, look at the horsies. Hello, horsies. I love the horsies. I hope they're being taken care of nicely. <sighs> they look okay. That tree is miraculous. It just stays as it is. That's one of the abilities that we develop um, when we learn Torah on a sufficiently, um, I guess you'd have to say correct level, is that you can make time either flow or not at will so that if you like something at a given time you can have it remain in that time and other things flow and it stays as it is it's pretty cool so we have this marvelously ethereal piece above and normal sea below there was no flooding from the rain. There was no destruction of the trees. The people are coming and going as they need to. So this is the, the correct, the correct uh, you assume, how do you, uh, um, application, I guess you'd say, of being able to make peace, that it's integrated into normal life. It's not unreal. It's not surreal. Um, it's balanced with, with physicality. That's what happens when we can connect heaven and earth. So some people think that because they hear traffic in my videos that, oh no, that's not peace. I can hear some noise. Yeah, of course you can hear noise. You're hearing the normal noises of life, which is the way it's supposed to be.